Okay, can you make it quieter? Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we are here in my basement and okay, we are doing an unboxing, which is something I never did before. Basically, before I start, welcome to my channel and my name is Michelle and I'm so glad you're here. Not gonna lie, this was kind of like the most hectic reason to get a MacBook. And shout out to my parents because they've given me so much for my channel and like without them I wouldn't have this because your girl is broke. I'm actually literally so thankful for this. <gasps> Last night I was literally having a breakdown because my MacBook was not working and I was like, I promised a video for you guys and it literally wasn't working. And I just, everything was broken, including my connector. And yeah, it was just not the vibe. And in no way or no means am I bragging money. In no mean am I bragging about money or like getting a new MacBook or anything. It's just, I thought this would be kind of fun to show you guys what I got. And like, just in case any YouTubers out there trying to figure out if, you know, what computer to get to edit. Let's see if I can edit a whole video today and upload it tomorrow. So here we are, um, let's begin. So here I have this MacBook Pro 2020. It is a 13 inch MacBook Pro 2020 and I got it in, wait, I don't know what to show you. I got it with 250, yeah, 256 gigabytes, the computer space and I recommend getting at least 256 because my last computer was a MacBook Air and it had 120 I think 20 something and it ran out like every time I tried to edit a video which was not fun at all so yeah my dad told me there was like two types but I don't really know the difference but my dad did the research and he chose this one which is apparently supposed to be the best for like video editing let's actually open it now I've been talking so long so I just took off the wrapper peeling and this is just like the box and I love how Apple products always come with like really good packaging. I don't know because I've never gotten other like companies I think, other, other brands. No. This is just like the packaging that it comes in. Surprise Johnny! For the color, I don't know if the, I don't know the other colors of this but I just I got the space gray. I used to have a rose gold MacBook, but it gets really tiring over time. But I love space gray. It's literally so pretty. Look at this. So pretty. Oh my god. And so before I go into my computer, I just want to show you guys what's in the box and also my connector that I got for you YouTubers who will be needing this. So first my connector my dad just got me the apple connector for sd cards because i was using one that came with my camera and it was really flimsy it also broke last night so love that for me so my dad went ahead and bought me this which i'm also really thankful for thank you it's a lot stronger i'm pretty sure we're hoping um so it looks like this Your SD card from your camera that you have all your clips in are gonna be going inside here and then here you're gonna be plugging it into your MacBook. It has like this weird round shape at the tip which is like an Apple design so it only works on Apple and I think there's like one other company that it'll work with. Moving on to the Apple box, um, it comes with the charger which is also made only for Apple products. What I mean is the both sides are the same with that round apple shape so it'll only work with like an apple uh, whoa wait this is huge guys these keep getting bigger okay so making this a lot more extra than it needs to be but you know it only has that circle shape so only the apple charger will fit oh my gosh it's so shiny look at that but yeah every apple product comes with the apple stickers now getting into the actual macbook which is like the most exciting part Whoa, so I have to like peel off this paper. Guys, it's so shiny and clean. Y'all, my screen is like all messy from touching it, but this one is not messy. To use English, 
English is the main language. Press the return key. Wait, okay, before I set this up, I want to show you guys the computer because it's cool. So basically right here, the control is like a swiping pad. So it's basically like a phone. So for volume, everything would be here and you would press this or like screen instead of these type of key buttons, which is really cool. I'm just gonna be making my language English, obviously. I am going to be signing in with my Apple ID just to put that in there. And um, I'm pretty sure I heard someone say that Final Cut Pro or like whatever editing system you bought, if you bought it through your Apple ID, it will stay. So Final Cut Pro, I won't like need to pay again. I haven't done this in a while. So this is all kind of new to me also. So I just need to set up a password. So I think it's just gonna take some time to set up my computer, but I'm honestly not sure. So I will get back to you guys when it works. Okay, and basically the rest of this is just like setting up my MacBook in really easy ways, just like, like my password and stuff. Hey guys, so ignore how messy the back of my room is right now, um, but I just wanted to come in and tell you guys a little bit more about the MacBook and how it was because I've been using it for about a week now and I just wanted to give you guys an update on the MacBook. So ignore like my screenshots and stuff and I learned more about this touchpad right here. Oh yeah, it's called the touchpad. I don't think I knew that when I was first filming this. So one thing I learned is that Final Cut Pro works so much better on this computer and I don't really have any issues with like my computer shutting down or having issues while editing. And it's honestly really smooth and downloads my files a lot faster. So basically everything just runs smoother on this. And so what's cool is right here on the touchpad, I can see all the little edits and cuts that I've made in my video. And I can just kind of scroll and find what part I want to get to just by looking at all the edits on a mini screen, which I think is super helpful. And also you can call Siri right here with this button. Um, so when I go to messages, if I were to text something and just be like, you know, whatever, there's also a emoji button right here and it can just show like, um, so it can just show like the emojis. This is cool because other MacBooks you have to download them, but on here it's just already installed with all the emojis that exist, so I think that's really cool. The last known thing I know is that you can see all of your Google websites right here on the touchpad, so you can choose whatever you want to get to. So if I want to do get to Google, I could just press that and go straight to Google instead of having to search it up. I definitely recommend getting a MacBook Pro if you're thinking about doing any editing type stuff. And yeah, so I think I'm going to end this video here because I have fed you all the information that I know. And yeah, so that is it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed this little unboxing type video and i hope to see you guys in the next video love you bye